welcome students today i will be teaching you verbs so let's take a tour in the world of verbs to begin with what are verbs verbs are words that express action being and possession remember students without a verb a sentence is always incomplete so let us see some kinds of verbs number 1 action verbs an action verb describes what someone or something is doing examples she tasted the stew the bus arrived on time the word tasted arrived are action verbs some more action verbs are jumps plays dances reads number 2 linking verbs a linking verb links the subject to a subject complement that identifies or describe the subject examples the stew tasted good his name is james the word tasted is are linking words some more linking words are am are were was will be has is have had let us see some more examples he had a dog named snoopy old men have gray hair number 3 helping verbs a helping verb works together with the main verb examples she is leaving i have finished my work the word is have are helping verbs they are helping the main verb leaving finished to complete the sentence look here children martha is studying in her room grandfather was praying in his room as you can see a helping verb always comes before a main verb that ends with i n g and e d some more examples many seagulls are flying over the sea i am enjoying a beautiful scene at the sea show number 4 subject verb agreement what is a subject subject is the word or group of words about which we are talking in a sentence what is a verb verb is the word that tells about the action being performed or the state of being of the subject a subject and a verb must agree with one another in number be it singular or plural let us see some examples two dogs are sitting on the grass two dogs plural subject are plural verb the subject and verb agree with one another in this sentence one dog is sitting on the grass one dog singular subject is singular verb singular subject and singular verb agree with one another in this sentence 
if a subject is singular its verb must be singular if a subject is plural its verb must be plural let us see some more examples dog is the most popular pet the action of a dog is most pleasing for its master we are going for a trek many people are fond of pets number 5 transitive verb a transitive verb is an action verb that is followed by a noun or pronoun that receives the action a transitive verb has a direct object let us see some examples i ate my lunch quickly dad measured the table carefully jenny dusts the desk every day number 6 intransitive verb an intransitive verb does not have a direct object examples the sun rises in the east she walks quickly the words rises and walks are intransitive as there can be no object in the sentence using these words examples i ate quickly dad measured carefully jenny dusts every day so students today we have discussed verbs action words helping words linking words subject verb agreement transitive verbs and intransitive verbs hope you enjoyed today's lesson thank you